So we're going to work now on trying to develop this horse to canter with the garage pole. So uh, Daniel's never ridden this horse before, never done this before with this horse. So is this going to be a good example to see of uh, where this horse is in his level and also Daniel where he's at. So we don't expect perfection here. We strive for excellence, not perfection. And uh, we're going to do this right now just to see what it is we have to work on. So go ahead. <clears throat> so we had the horse cantering properly without the garage pull first, obviously. So if we don't get but one or two circles, we're going to be happy with that. But Daniel worked with him on his departure and he worked with him on his transition in our previous videos to get him prepared to do this. Okay. Very good, very good, Daniel, very good. How about that? All right, now just stop, you're doing good. <clears throat> now, I want you to, remember how we did it, Daniel, where you laid the uh, pole on your shoulder? Do that now. Now, he's gonna lay the pole on his shoulder and then he's going to bring his hand down, bring your hand down, and he's going to keep that pole on his shoulder. But for him to balance that pole, you see how he's having to maneuver his hips and maneuver his body? Well, folks, that's how you ride a horse. If you want to learn to ride a horse with feel and with your legs and seat, this is what you got to do right here. 13 feet of PVC pipe, it's an inch and a half. PVC pipe. Cost you about $8. Doesn't have to be anything fancy. So Daniel's got the pole on his shoulder and he's balancing that. But, but the whole theory of this is I want you to watch his waist and his shoulders, how he's got to position himself to maintain that pole. Well, that horse is responding and learning to guide for him with his body like this, okay? How old are you, Daniel? Daniel's 15 years old. Came to work as an apprentice here back in the summer. Worked with Monroe all summer. Daniel didn't spend his summer playing basketball and water skiing and laying by the pool and getting tattoos, he was out here working. Well, look what you end up with. Hard work pays off. I'm proud of that young man. He's done very good. This makes me feel real good. All right, Trot. Okay. So we're not going to try to canter in this with holding the pole on your shoulder. Um, you know, you got to take this kind of in stride and in different stages. So, um, all right. So our next video, I'm going to talk about conditioning your horse for um, noises, sound.